what is a watt? A watt is a newton meter second. Okay, what does that mean? That means one watt is the energy required to lift one kilogram of weight one meter vertically using standardized gravity in one second. One kilogram of weight, one meter vertically in one second. That is a watt. It's a unit of energy expenditure. So when we talk about how many watts a rider is producing, it is how much energy they are expending at that moment, how much power they are putting into the bicycle. Now a lot of people miscomprehend this to meaning how much force, how hard they're pushing on the pedals. That is one component of producing watts or producing power on a bike is pushing hard on the pedal. If you simply push hard on the pedal and the crank arm doesn't move, you are producing zero watts. If you push very hard on the pedal and the crank arm moves very slowly, you are producing very few watts, no matter how strong you are. You could be pushing you could be pushing down with 500 pounds per square inch on the pedal. And if the pedal is barely moving, you're producing almost no watts. So it is not force. That is a misnomer. A watt, or how we develop it on a bicycle, is how hard you are pushing down on the pedal multiplied by the speed at which the pedal is going around. So for instance, there are two ways to produce 400 watts. One is by pushing very hard on the pedal and turning the crank arms very slowly, say maybe 50 RPM. Another would be to be pushing much more lightly on the pedal, but be turning the pedals at 120, 130 RPM. Either way produces 400 watts. Which way is better for you? It depends on your individual physiology. It depends on how you've been training. It depends how much time you've been in the gym. It depends on how strong you are versus how much aerobic capacity you have. A lot of different dependence. But what is a watt in terms of cycling? It is how hard you're pushing down on the pedal multiplied by how fast the pedal is moving around. That's a watt.